I was really challenged by the Spanish language. I would mix up French words with Spanish words and get looked at funny a lot. <laughs> After kind of getting over that and grasping at least the basics of Spanish, I came to the conclusion and I was able to realize that these are people that have opinions, that have perspectives, that have things to say that are important. And without the language, those perspectives would be completely closed off to me. Things that people told me while I was there, I've been able to draw on here. Um, I've been able to take away perspectives and share them with my friends and my family. And in that sense, I think it's really important. If I hadn't done that, then I wouldn't know those things, much less would I be able to share those things with other people. I realized my own biases and prejudices in the way that we do things here, in the way that I've been taught to think. And so being able to stop and realize that the world does things differently than the way that we do is really important. Um, and I think it's something that is looked over a lot. Also just realizing that not one form of education is better than the other and acknowledging that because these kids that I was working with are learning the same things that we learned, you know, in elementary school and middle school and high school. They're coming away with the same facts and knowledge that we did. The outcome is the same, but the ways of learning are different. And I think it's important to realize that we have common goals, but different ways of getting there. And you don't really think about if everything were to turn on the head and you were to be in a different country and speaking a different language, doing things differently than your everyday life, how that would change you and how that would affect your way of thinking. So it just puts you in a different position and forces you to think in different ways.